Hi, my name is Jennifer. I'm a group exercise instructor and physical therapist. Today's class is going to be a circuit style class. We are going to be doing strength, strength, and then a minute cardio boost. Some of the cardio boosts are high impact. I think all of them are. So listen to your body. If you need to keep it low impact, I will show those modifications. Don't do anything that hurts. Get water when you need it and let's get started. Oh, also weights are optional. So if we're doing squat with overhead press, you cannot use weight if you don't have that available to you at your house. Okay, let's get going. We're gonna get warmed up first, march it out. Take it out wide, out. Tap those toes, pull, 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 pull. One arm at a time. Both arms. Chest level. Pull it back. 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 Hamstring curl. Bend your knee. Hup. Overhead. Pull down. Pull. Pull. Toe down again. Side arms, press down, get lower. Heel to the front, heel, heel, heel. Four, three, two. Hold it down into a squat. Gonna get as low as you can to start with. Now come up, up, two, down, two. Up, two, down, two. As those joints start feeling warm, play with the depth of that squat. Hold it down and pulse. Down, down, down. Singles, go down and up. Hup. Now reach big on the up. Four, three, two, hold it up, deep breath, and out, take it out to a plie, drop down, open up those hips, knees to the back of the room, bring it up a little bit, toe forward a tad, and lunge it right and left. And reach. Up, pull, up, pull. Four, three, two. Plie the legs. Down, down. Four, three, two, one. Bring it in. I want you to stretch anything out that you feel like you need to for yourself, and then we'll get started. So, first thing we've got is alternating lunges with bicep curls, 15, and then we've got a squat overhead press. Okay, so your overhead press, I'm gonna keep mine close today. If you wanna go wide, that's fine. So grab those weights. Now, when you alternate those lunges, we're gonna go one, one, two, two, three, three, okay? To get to 15, make sure when you're stepping back that you're taking a big step and it's a drop down. So that front knee does not stay over those toes. If you would rather do an alternating front lunge, do that, okay? All right, I'm gonna actually push the music down just a tiny bit. So we've got these lunges alternating. I'm gonna start in a hammer position with my curl and rotate back upwards as I go, okay? Here we go. One, one, two, two, three, four, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12, 13, 14, one more. Now we've got our squat to an overhead press. One, two, three, four, five. Here's 15, put them down. We got one minute jacks. I'm gonna pitch the music back up. Well, let's keep it. Just keep going at your pace. I'm gonna pick it up faster than the music. So I'm not gonna be on beat. Again, go at your own pace. If you're low impact, you're here, but try to get real low to the ground. One, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Put them down. We got one minute worth of burpees. You do your burpee however you want. High jump, low back, you can chest push off the ground. We do have push-ups coming up, if that changes your mind on that. One minute, go.
some water. We got one more round, then we're doing it all again. Okay, we got a push up with an alternate toe tap out. So, you're gonna do your push up. And you're gonna tap, tap. If you're from your knees, you're still gonna tap. Down, tap, tap. You can also leave your feet down. Or just pause for a second. Or do more push-ups and those taps, okay? Yeah, we got 15. Then we're gonna come up, reverse fly. Then we got squat jumps. So 15 push-ups, get that core set, here we go, one, two, three, four, Two, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, One more. Up. Okay. Squat to that shoulder press. Fifteen. Get down. Press. One. Two. Three. Four. There's 15. One minute jack. Go. Again, I'm going to go faster than the music. Gonna do those curtsies, lateral raise. Again, I'm gonna switch my weight out just to protect my elbow a little bit. So we have curtsy lift, curtsy lift on the beat. Four, three, two, here we go. Out. Nine. 
10. Eleven. Eight, 
reverse fly. Come on up. We might even have one more. And we were slow too, but that's okay. All right. Reverse fly. Fifteen. Then squat up, then you're done. Unless you want to do it all over again. Here we go. Soft knees. Long spine. One more. Ha! Ah, put them down. Squat jumps to finish. What a way to finish. Again, go at your own speed. Low impact if you need to. One minute. Go! Starting again. Plant your feet. Inhale. Reach one arm down that spine. Take a hold of that elbow. Keep that heart lifted. Switch to the other arm. Bring an arm across. Now, we're just doing a few second holds for these stretches. This is not going to improve flexibility. This is just like, hey, I'm stretching after I worked out. So if you need more flexibility, switch arms. you got to make sure you're holding your stretches for at least 30 seconds. And release that. We're going to take it down for a hip flexor stretch. Knee down. Front foot a little further than your knee. Drop yourself forward. Get that hip flexor. Now, that's a little too intense. One hand or both to the floor. Pull those hips back. Lift up on that front toe. Keep that back nice and long. Get that hamstring. Again, think about taking that heart outward. If you have that mobility, you can take it as low as what you can. Switch legs. Again, we're not holding this for long enough to get that flexibility component. Just lengthening these muscles after we've worked them out. So we're on that other hip flexor. Make sure that front knee does not cross that front toe. Pull those hips back. Keep that heart outward. Now you may just be here on fingertips. If you can go palm, or again, any lower than what you can. 
with good form. Bring it up. Now step yourself all the way back up. Reach back, grab a hold of that foot. Stretch out that quad. Make sure that leg is parallel to the other. Maybe back a little bit, but just make sure it's not out to the side. You want it down. Do whatever you need to for balance with that other arm. Switch it. Grab that other foot. And again, make sure it's not out. Tuck it in. Maybe back a little. Thank you so much for working out with me today. Today was the first day of quarantine again. <laughs> Release. Press the heel back. So for three weeks, no more indoor classes. No group exercise classes. Switch feet. Back toe facing forward. So I'll be posting a little bit more over the next few weeks, hopefully. So if you have requests, let me know. Bring it in, take a deep breath. And out, and again, I always encourage more stretching for flexibility. Enjoy the rest of your day. And again, if you wanna back it up, do it again, okay? I'll see you guys later. <laughs>